Good morning, Wrestling Fan Nation. Thank you all for tuning in to the show. How you guys doing today? I thank you for tuning in, subscribing, and supporting the Wrestling Talk Show. For more of these wrestling uh, these wrestling news updates, WWE 2K16 content videos, and all the news when they're put, putting news out for the new game, and when my new add-ons where I talk about Raw, SmackDown, um, pay-per-view matches, new matches, old-school matches, guys, then subscribe to my show. The logo is going to be up top, and I want you guys to click on it. You're going to be officially subscribed to my show. Now, the article is going to be in the description box for you guys, as always. Breaking news, guys. Breaking news. <clears throat> Breaking news on WWE superstar Brock Lesnar on his schedule. Now, Brick, Brock Lesnar was advertised to be on Monday Night's Raw in Nashville, Tennessee, but didn't appear. Several correspondents at the set word that a lot of the fans booed when Paul Heyman left after his promo and were upset that Lesnar wasn't there. Now, speaking of Brock, he is not advertised for next week's Raw and is only advertised for two shows before WrestleMania, the March 9th at the Console Energy Center in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, and WrestleMania Go Home Show Raw at the Staples Center in Los Angeles, California. Wow. So a lot of people really booed Paul Heyman when he left. Now, I understand, you know, well, you know, Brock Lesnar is supposed to be there because Roman Reigns um, beat, you know, Roman Reigns beat Daniel Bryan at the Fast Lane pay per view. So we expect to see Brock Lesnar there at the Monday Night Raw. We expect that, but it didn't happen. Um, so I understand a lot of people are mad about it that he, you know, that we fans were expecting the WWE World Heavyweight Champion Brock Lesnar to be at the Raw, the Raw show, okay, to confront Roman Reigns. That maybe there was going to be confrontation between these two at Monday Night Raw last night, but it didn't happen. Brock did not show up. So they booed Paul Heyman because of that. Listen, ladies and gentlemen, you know, Paul didn't do nothing. Paul didn't do nothing. Yes, I know since Paul's there, Brock has to be there too. You know, I'm not mad that Brock was not there. Because technically, he doesn't really need to be there. Because um, Roman Reigns already won the Royal Rumble already. Okay, so Brock, Brock said, I didn't have to be there because this wasn't a big match. And um, Brock Lesnar, uh, Roman Reigns, and Fast and Daniel Bryan, that was not really a big deal of a match. So he's like, well, I don't have to be there then because it's not a big deal of a match. It doesn't mean nothing, you know. The Royal Rumble is different. Then, you know, the next night he would be there, you know. Brock would be there. That's different. But, you know, so I understand, you know, that, you know, Brock didn't have to be there. And he's only scheduled for different um, um, shows, so, yeah, your comments, your opinions, guys, and I'm not mad about it. I'm not. I'm not mad that he was not there, you know. I know a lot of fans say he should be there, but technically he doesn't have to be there because it wasn't really a major big win for Roman Reigns because we already know that he already was the Royal Rumble winner anyway, so it doesn't change nothing, you know. So Brock didn't have to be there. It didn't mean nothing to him, you know. It was a meaningless match. Um, so your comments, your opinions, guys, and subscribe to my show. You know, I think, guys, leave me your comments as always. Please like this video, thumbs it up, share it to all your friends, and I thank you all for tuning in to the morning show. Have a good day, guys, and I'll see you on the next show. Thank you. Subscribe.